everyone and welcome to my channel and in this video what we're going to be doing is making another modded outfit so this is going to be a purple modded outfit just like the thumbnail and we will be doing the transfer glitch so unfortunately yeah we're going to be losing a lot of our outfits doing this but we will be gaining a super try hard outfit so what I've done is I've done power play and power play is a job that gets you like orange joggers and purple joggers with the bulletproof helmets. So I will have that link down in the descriptions below, but this is what's going to happen here is unfortunately, yep, we're going to lose all these outfits. So I saved this outfit right here to slot one because we're not going to lose one of our outfits. Okay. We're just going to lose like the rest of them, unfortunately, by doing this glitch. So right here, you guys, this is what we're going to do is we're going to go to the top section. We're going to go to the section here and just go ahead and put that on. And then after that, we are good to go. So let's go ahead and press our pause menu and we're gonna go into manage characters at this time. And what we're gonna be doing is creating a female character. If you guys do not have a female character along with your male character, so this is going to be female components to a male character, okay? And also we will be losing our second character as well as we are going to be deleting the second character here in just a moment's time. So it looks like I don't have a female character. If you guys are in the same situation as me, you're going to have to create one real quick. So just go ahead and choose this character. And then once we get into creator or character creation here, we can go ahead and just uh, turn it into a female real quick. Go to the options, choose it, female. There you go. We're not going to name it or do anything like that. We're just going to go ahead and take her right into an online session at this time. Now, potentially, you guys will wind up in an online session with a lot of players. So if you guys want to go ahead and just go into an invite-only session, you can do that too. So I'm going to be doing this in an invite-only session because I don't want other players uh, going to the clothing store and messing up like me potentially getting components here, which has happened before. So, you know. All right, you guys, so we're at the store. Let's go ahead and go inside. We're going to be building about four outfits here, but they're going to be simple. All right, so this is the first outfit, and we're going to be going to the top section, and we're going to go all the way down here. I believe number 12, and then we're going to be choosing number 38 right here. And we're going to back out. We're going to go down, down, down to this section. Then we're going to choose number 60. Then we can back out. Then we're going to go over here to the pants section. And we're going to be choosing these right here. Number one, muscle, the spotted muscle pants. All right. And then we're going to be getting some shoes here. And the shoes that we're going to be getting are going to be those Tron shoes that are in the thumbnail there. It's going to be pretty cool. All right. So we're going to go here and we're going to be choosing number 21 for the shoes there. And then we're going to walk over to the accessories, which in this store, you guys can shop at a different store if you want to. I was just closest to this store. All right. So we're going to go ahead and go into the accessories. We're going to choose this one right here, number 40 for the earrings. Then we're going to go down to the chains, I believe. And then we're going to choose number 32 right here. All right. Perfect. All right, then we're gonna go ahead and save this. Let's save this to slot number two right here. And as you guys can see, we have other outfits that we're gonna be making. So this is the next outfit that we're gonna go ahead and make. So we're gonna keep the rest of the stuff on there. And then we're just gonna go over to the top section real quick. We're gonna go to denim jackets, I believe this is. And then also I do have the list and the numbers for all of the components down in the descriptions below. If you guys wanna just go ahead and use that real quick. So denim jackets, number 52, it looks like. And then after this, we're going to be putting a bikini on her. So we got to go to the bikini section right here. And then we're just going to choose number one. Let's just go ahead and put that one on. All right, perfect. Now we're going to go save this outfit. Don't worry about any of the rest of the components. We're just going to keep those on there. And we're going to put this on the third slot right here. So we're going to save that to the third slot. Now we're going to work on this outfit right here. So once again, we're going to go to the top section. Super easy to do here. And I think we're going to be going to bomber, some sort of bomber jackets. Yep, right there. And then we're going to choose number seven. And then from here, you guys, we're going to go ahead and put on standard body armor. So right there, standard body armor. Go ahead and save this to slot four. I believe that we're on right now or three. 
And then the next one we're going to make is this one. This also has some different armor that we're going to go ahead and save. So we're going to go to the top section. We're going to go down here. And we're going to choose number 10 for this striped shirt here, or jacket. Then we're going to back out, pop open our interaction menu. Once again, go into inventory, go on down to body armor. And then we're going to change this body armor into heavy armor. So just right here. Perfect. And then we're going to go ahead and save this to the next slot down. Yeah, there you go, right there. All right, and we're going to go ahead and put on this outfit. And you guys can see i got all my outfits now. And your outfit should look just like mine as we're scrolling through here. All right, perfect. So what we're going to do now is pop open our interaction menu and take the easy way out. So let's go ahead and do that real quick. This is going to go ahead and force a save in the game. This is something necessary that I do every single time when I'm doing this glitch. All right, perfect. There we go. We've taken the easy way out, and we're just waiting for the little orange loading circle in the bottom right-hand corner. Got that. Let's pop open our options menu here, our uh, pause menu. We're going to go into Rockstar Creator, okay? So we're actually going to go ahead and start a race at this time. We're going to create a race, and we're going to go into the tutorial. So just waiting for the options to pop open real quick. Should be any second. All right, there we go. Create a race, just like this. And then we're going to go into tutorial. So choose tutorial and then just go ahead and accept this alert right here. So once we get in here, press your pause menu. And what we're going to go ahead and do is go into Rockstar Management Creator. So we're going to go into Manage Creator right here. Our characters or Manage crea uh, Characters, I mean. All right. So at this time, what we're going to be doing is deleting our female character. Do not delete your main character. You will lose a lot of stuff that you do not want to lose. So make sure it is your second character that you are deleting at this time. So we're going to go over to the second character. We're going to go ahead and delete her. Now, if you guys are on old gen like PS4 or Xbox One, what you're simply going to do is just back out and go to story mode. Now, if you guys are on new gen like Xbox Series X and S and or PS5, this is what we're going to do at this time is we're going to go over to our second character. We're going to hover over them and we're going to go ahead and join one of our friends. You can also join an Anawak bot account at this time as well, and it will pop up with one alert. So I'm just going to go ahead and join one of my friends at this time. It's going to pop up with an alert. Do you want to join this person? I'm just going to go ahead and accept that. And now at this time, what's going to happen is it's going to throw me into an online session. Once we get into an online session, we're going to go ahead and merge the outfit at this time by doing a G thing and or by doing um, something like a fleek job. So it didn't put me into an online. It looks like it looks like I'm actually getting kicked to story here. So that's just fine. So we're actually going to get kicked to story. That's perfect. And then from here, I'm going to go ahead and start up like an invite only or a closed friend session real quick. So let's go ahead and do that. And then once we go ahead and do this, once again, for the merge jobs, we can either do the Felica heist over at the apartment and or we can just do like a G thing, I think, which is a bookmark job. All right, guys. But first things first, we're going to go ahead and go into the store. I'm going to go to the accessories here. We're going to go to here, and I'm going to put on one of these scarves. I want one of these on there. I'm going to put on this one right here. You should try it on. This is just for the outfit, an extra component. We're going to save this to slot 20. All right, guys? So save this outfit to slot 20. And then from here, what we're going to go ahead and do is go into our bookmark jobs. And for this particular method, I'm just going to do a G thing. And I'm going to go ahead and grab my friend Gravesite. All right, so make sure when you guys do get in here, put it to player owned clothing. That's going to be very important for either the Felica method and or a G thing method. All right, so there's Gravesite. Just join me. Awesome. Thanks, bro. No problem. We're going to go ahead and start this up. Now, once we do start this up, you guys are going to have to remember where your apartments are because we are going to our apartments. Now, once we do get into this section right here, just go right. Okay, so that's all we're pressing. We're just going to keep pressing right just like this. And then we're going to press left and then right again. So just like this. You guys see this? 
So I've got the galaxy top, I've got purple armor, I've got those gloves, I've got my purple joggers, we've got Tron shoes. So we're gonna go ahead and accept this right now and we're gonna go ahead and start this up. And we're, we need to save this outfit at this time, so that's why I was saying earlier, if you guys know where your apartments are, that's gonna be great because, uh, you know, if not, then that's gonna suck. Potentially because your apartments might not be marked on the map. So we're just gonna go to our apartment, we're gonna run inside and we're gonna save this outfit. Which looks pretty dope. And then I'll show you guys what we're going to be doing to get our mask and stuff back real quick. Alright, so we're going to run in here. We're going to run into the clothing or the clothing closet. <laughs> Sorry, I was like trying to say both those words at the same time. And all we got to do now is just save the outfit. Alright, we're going to save this to like slot one. You can save this outfit to whatever. At this time, looks pretty dope to me. Looks pretty clean. And then we're going to finish it off by getting him his bulletproof helmet back. And then also like a galaxy mask to go with it. Because it's going to look pretty cool. Alright guys, I'm just backing out of the job real quick. And then from here, you guys can see. Bam, there it is. Alright, and I still have my purple helmet. So we're going to go ahead and equip the purple helmet outfit on real quick. I'm just going to run into my apartment. Because my apartment has a telescope. So we're just going to be doing the telescope glitch real quick. Which is going to allow us to transfer the helmet from this outfit on over to that modded outfit that I just made. Oh, Got to run by the telescope. Press right on the D-pad. Damn, there you go. All right, pop open our interaction menu, go to style, and we're just gonna go ahead and choose that outfit right there, walk away. Bam, there's our purple helmet. And then all you guys gotta do at this time is just go ahead and overwrite the save. There it is. Yeah, now it's looking pretty clean. Purple joggers, we got purple armor, purple helmet, Tron shoes, the racing gloves, galaxy top. All right. So for here, to go ahead and get the mask, we're just going to go ahead and choose the galaxy top real quick. So check this out. And then we're just going to run by the telescope again. Press right on the D-pad. Pop open our interaction menu. Go into style. And then go into the outfit we just saved. Just like that. Walk away. Bam. There you go. We got ourselves a pretty sick looking purple modded outfit that you guys can copy and you can wear this around. This like almost looks like a save wizard outfit if you ask me in a sense because uh, it looks pretty dope. The only other thing I would think to add to this maybe would be like an AAA badge or, or I mean an IAA badge and an FIB uh, badge on the on the waistband there. But anyway, so there you guys, let me know what you guys think about this outfit and let me know if you guys want me to do more outfits here on the channel. But from there, thanks for watching. Hope the video was uh, helpful and hope you guys are doing good and having an awesome rest of the day. Thanks for watching. My name is Gravesite and I will see you in the next one. So peace.